Hello, and welcome to the SAP Business One overview video. Today, we're going to be looking at sales. And specifically under sales, we're going to be looking at a sales AR invoice. So there's a couple of different ways that I can do an AR invoice. I can click directly on the menu here and it takes me to a blank screen. It opens that up as full screen or I can bring that down to a manageable size. I can also look through my sales process that we have here on my board and we can see that I have an AR invoice directly uh, as part of my process steps. So I can click on that also, and you can see that that takes me to a blank AR invoice. Now I can also go in and if I wanted to, I could duplicate an existing invoice by right clicking here, and we can see that I can go down and I can uh, duplicate this directly from this AR invoice, making it very simple and easy to be able to process ARs. However, what we're going to do is we're gonna follow the process step as per some of my other videos. We had created a sales quotation, and then from a sales uh, quotation, we created a sales order, and then from a sales order, we created a delivery. So let's go look at that previous delivery that has been created and we're going to look at that relationship map and we're going to see here's our quotation, here's our sales order, and here's our delivery. And I'm going to create an AR invoice directly from this delivery. Very simple and easy process for me to do. I'm going to go down here to my copy two. Under my copy two, I'm going to create this as a AR invoice. This invoice has now been created pulling over all of the information that was on my delivery. I can make changes if I want, but as you notice here, you can see that this is based on a quotation, based on a sales order, based on a delivery. So it provides me a very nice visual process uh, as I go through step by step within uh, business one. Now I'm just going to add that into the system. I'm going to get rid of that message here. And we're going to add that on into the system so that now I have the next step of my process. So let's go back to that last document that I just created. And what you're going to notice now when I go to my relationship map, Look how nice this is. I now have my quotation to my sales order, sales order to delivery. All of these documents have been closed because you can see that little lock. I have my AR invoice, which is now still open. So now I can receive and expect incoming payment from my customer. So clicking back on that AR invoice once more, we can see that under my logistical tab, all of the information for my ship to and bill to came over and all of the accounting information was automatically created. So if we go back into our AR delivery notice here and I go down, I can look at all of the posting detail documents. We can see the journal entry that was automatically created from this invoice with no action that I had to do on my part. It was automatically created in the system for me. Thank you very much for listening today to my uh, sales overview on AR invoices.